And in the South Valley, Cahuilla Delta Medical Center believes the worst is yet to come. While the pandemic hasn't overwhelmed their hospital, staff are bracing for when it might come. Our Dennis Valera reports on how they're gearing up for a possible surge in COVID-19 patients. We're not fooling ourselves. Uh, we fully expect that it's going to continue to escalate. As of this morning, Cahuilla Delta reports of the nearly 900 swabs they've submitted for testing, 48 tested positive for COVID-19. Of that, five are still being treated at the hospital, four of which are on ventilators in the ICU. With around 50 ventilators left, Cahuilla Delta CEO Gary Herbst says orders are in. They just haven't been filled yet. Generally, those larger communities that are being more hit more severely right now are where most of the, the ventilator supplies are going to. According to Tulare County numbers, the majority of confirmed cases are in the immediate Visalia area. To deal with a possible surge, the hospital now has dedicated two units, 40 beds, specifically for COVID-19 patients. The opening of two floors in its Ezekiel wing will open up dozens more. But in the case all of that gets filled up, Herb says city leaders have offered up the city's convention center. Um, if you need to take over the convention center, you're, not, you're going to be at the top of our list. And obviously so many events have been canceled now. Um, it's quite available. Now, in case even more beds are needed, Cahuilla Delta has already made plans to bring its pediatric and NICU patients here to Valley Children's. Dennis Valera, KC24, local news that matters.